Hello, and welcome to Computer Tech and More. Today I want to talk about vibration pads for your hard drives. So, uh, most consumer hard drives are, like Western Digital Reds, are good for about eight bays. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And the Pro and Enterprise drives are good for uh, more bays, basically, more number of hard drives in the same enclosure. But I personally find that uh, I have this uh, cube style uh, unit that I hold all of my external hard drives on. So this is my NAS. It's a, a Synology DS1819 Plus. And then I have a 5 bay and a Drobo. And when if I have all of them on, so these two would be backing up my Synology here that vibrations could travel through this whole shelf into ba basically into each other and uh, you want to minimize the amount of vibrations that can go from one hard drive to another so that's uh, one of the key reasons that i am talking about vibration pads so first they all come with these little rubber trying to get it zoomed in there little rubber footies and even the Drobo and, and uh, this DAS direct access storage DAS uh, 5 bay unit have little rubber feet on them. But I find that uh, vibrations still travel through the shelf. Like if this is on right now, so if I, I was accessing the hard drives and without these feet, I would feel vibrations through here. And that could travel into these. So I have, uh, this is rubber, and then a foam in the middle, and it's got rubber on the bottom. Uh, these are actually for like wash machines and like dryers and stuff, but I find that it does a really good job on the hard drives. I don't feel any vibrations running through the table. I'm sorry, I don't have any test equipment to actually show you the, the difference there. And I bought two different kinds uh, back in the day when I bought these. So this one that I have on this 5 bay uh, from uh, Sabrinth is rubber topped with cork in the middle and then rubber on the bottom. These pads are much larger, you can see. So this is where I was talking about like for a wash machine, whatever, to reduce vibrations that go through your floor. And it still does a great job uh, isolating this, this drive bay, this drive unit from the one right next to it. And this one, I didn't go out and buy more, more vibration pads, so I jerry-rigged my own. In one of my previous videos, I talked about uh, flooring in my basement. And I actually used scrap pieces, so it's rubber-topped, and a dense foam. So you wanna make sure that you, it's a denser foam. And I have the, the Drobo with all its hard drives sitting on the rubber side so it doesn't crush as easily and permanently deform as the foam side. Like if it was the foam side, it would actually compress more easily than the rubber side, ironically. And it's just two layers, permanently like, like that, into one big piece. And that, that isolates this one from this one and all these from that. Again, most of my hard drives are consumer grade Western Digital uh, reds. I don't have very many pro and enterprise models, although I've started acquiring more for the backup solution as opposed to the main uh, NAS. So having a, the, the ones that are actually enterprise dampened uh, matters a lot more when it's in the same space as the regular reds because the, uh, the pros and the Enterprise seem to vibrate more. They move more readily and make more noise. So uh, I feel that there must be more vibration, but that helps isolate everything from each other so that uh, hopefully hard drives last a little bit longer. But uh, this is my short video on vibration pads for your hard drives and enclosures. Um, oh, one other note, if you're just talking about like an external uh, hard drive enclosure for like one hard drive uh, that's meant for temporary use to be only like accessed 
short periods of time, not continuously all the time, then I don't see a reason why you would need to to have vibration pads. But if you have something that's going to be on a lot and that kind of thing, having vibration pads is never a bad thing. But thank you again for watching and have a great day.